leads a difficult result. What are your thoughts? No, listen, um, I thought uh, Taunton are a really well-oiled machine. Um, I think Rob's got a real decent outfit here, and I think they're going to go really close, really close to winning the league. Um, we we started, we, we wanted to go with a win first half, and uh, just to try and make sure we weren't under massive pressure. And we didn't really get going, I didn't think. I thought we were poor in, in possession of the ball, I thought we were wasteful. We played a different shape, which probably looking back now, going with a win, we probably should have just reverted to what we normally play, um, which we've done with sort of 10 minutes and a half to go. But they've scored a, a, a great finish, you know, just disappointed we've left 2v1. But, you know, you come to these places, you need a little bit of help sometimes when you come to good sides. And the, the, the referee today, you know, they've got keepers absolutely time wasted like you wouldn't believe if we were 1-0 up today and my goalkeeper had done that I've no doubt he'd be booked you know I know what they're trying to do and they've done it really well but at some point you need the referee to help you you know and then second half we come out and we have a great position free kick and um, we've got the wrong taker taking it we haven't listened to our jobs the break on us get a corner and score and then um, we scored and I thought we were outstanding after that. I thought we played really, really well. I thought we uh, passed the ball brilliantly. I thought Jaden Clark, hands were, were outstanding. Um, Aaron was back to his old self. We looked really good. And then I go back to it again. We come to decisions and Cuba gets the ball played in behind him. He runs in behind him. Lads push him over. We're standing right there. It's a free kick. Referee don't give it. Ten seconds later, Joshua Kocha goes and wins a great header. Our ref gives a free kick and they score. By the way, what a finish. You know, what a finish. But... These are the fine details that you really need to go your way when you come to a tough place like Taunton. And it hasn't gone our way. And it's not sour grapes, it's only the truth. You know, um, I thought Taunton were the better side in the first half. I thought they were the better side probably over the, over the whole game and deserved their win. We got down the sides of them three or four times, second half caused them problems. At 3-1, three, three we've had a goal that's, um, that's been disallowed for offside. If that goes in, you know, we've got 10 minutes to really put the pressure on. But I felt that... Taunton were very comfortable and, and as I say, listen, I thought they were a very, very good side, very strong side, but I'm pleased with the second half. We could have folded um, at 2 0, but we had a real good go. I just spoke to the boys in there. For, for me, what lets us down from us being a really good side is the 1%. And the 1% of defending your box, attacking their box, and we've conceded from a corner, we've conceded from a set piece, and we've conceded from a cross. Normally we're getting you know, peppered when we come here and, and the goal getting um, uh, battered, but it never really happened today. You know, Ethan hasn't had to make great saves, but you know, it's, it's just a frustration, Jack, in that I thought we had a really good goal in the second half. I needed it in the first half, we weren't quite at it. Um, but tough, tough conditions, fair play to Taunton getting the game on. And um, no, very good side, and um, no, they'll take their win and, and fair play to them. We'll be